back again. Here we go. I'm making a bad habit of this, but I'm back again, once again, with another video for our beloved local wings. I made a video just, just recently. I tried the wings loaded box. Basically, I didn't go for the, uh, what they're known for, their wings. But here I am today. Here's the receipt. Is it ready? Just on its own. Oh gosh, it was six pounds something with an upgrade, new upgrade for one ninety five. The fries and the drinks. Like I did on my last video, I'm going to do a full factor. So one to ten. Ten being the highest, mean I'm extremely full, and one mean not satisfied at all. Once again, there's a good amount of weight to it. For the uh, grilled wings. And I went for the smoky barbecue sauce and the hot buffalo sauce. So I asked to mix it up a little bit. So I'm, let's just see what we're going to say. Here we go. Oh yeah. Holy cow. Look at that. I mentioned this last time on my video uh, about the beautiful cooked fries with the lovely help, uh, generous seasoning this time around by the looks of it. And onto the main attraction, the main feature, their wings. So there should be a, a, a fair mixture here. There should be the, the, the barbecue wings. I think we were able to tell which. I think those ones down there are the barbecue wings indeed. And they're, they're obviously the reddish color of the uh, 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 buffalo. Wow, I'm impressed. Once again, it's gonna be a messy job, but they've only given me a little lousy few napkins here and their lovely plastic forks. Mm. Second time I've been now, and the fries are tasting just good the first time. I love the crunch, the uh, season, the whole season that's going on. So, in number one, this plus, I think it's a barbecue sauce. Exactly what we're looking at. Look at the way the thing is finely coated with all the nice garnishings. Wow. Mmm. Mmm. I think this is the buffalo one. Look at that buffalo, like Tabasco y kind of sauce taste. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah. This is going to be a messy job, that's for sure. What? Look how tiny this is! Look at that! It's tiny! It's like a baby or something. There we go. Comes mm. right off the bone as well, you know. This is their, their smoky barbecue sauce, you can tell. Alright, two wings in already. <laughs> There's a wing. Mm. Wow. So far, really good. Buffalo is it's basically normal. I wouldn't say it's... I can't say it's... um. So far, like amazing, absolutely amazing. Where I will never go back to another place for a wing. The guy still, as far as I'm concerned, places like Pepe's, Franzos, and I'm sure I missed a few out. Uh, Eden, Eden and Gansill, Eden Perry Chicken. Their wings are just as good as well. I mean, I mean, the thing that, that these guys I think do is like they they kind of do the fine garnishing on it to make it look nice, and I do like their fries. If I'm honest, I, I think I prefer the barbecue uh, taste. They're both nice, but I, mean, I think I prefer, for some reason I prefer the barbecue one. And I really like how the meat comes off the bone with ease. It is a messy job. Don't get me wrong, it's a messy job. Expect them when you have wings. Mm. I do like them both. I really do like them both, but I think, I think still at the moment, the barbecue one's got the edge. Yeah, look at that. That's a tip, trick I uh, learned over the years. Only messy foods, sticky, like kind of thing like wings, sticky type of food like wings. All you need to do is put your greasy ass finger on there. Wife hat. <laughs> it is messy though, but it's, it's delicious. So far, it's going good. Got about four or five wings left. Mm. Right off the bone. Very messy but delicious. I'm actually surprised this was cooked quicker than the loaded box because surely the loaded box would take a lot quicker than grilled chicken. I mean, this is already grilled. I don't know, but it's fresh and it's hot and steaming when I open it up. But I remember waiting the first time around quite a lot longer than the And they weren't even busy. There was no one there. This time there was a few people there. So they had a few orders going on before me. Mm. Look at that. I'm miss you, dude. <laughs> I mentioned on my, on my on my last video, I said the loaded box you couldn't eat in the car. I mean, technically you could, as long as you're a clean eater. I'm a messy eater. I get, I tend to get food all over my uh, moustache and beard. So I'm, I'm glad I'm situated here. But this one would definitely, definitely be a difficult thing to try and, you know, eat in your car. My hands are sticky, like really sticky. I feel like I'm Spider-Man. Hi. <sighs> it's time to get full. 
freaking knife on story happened to pack up me right last minute. The difference in the sound, audio, apologies if you're watching it and you only got this far, but if I had to resort, resort to using a Marvel phone. Alright, back in business. So there we go. So those are all the wings so far. It was delicious. Both flavors were really good. And as you can see, I've still got a bit of fries left, so I'm going to enjoy that now and give my final review. ASMR lovers would appreciate the crunch. Yeah. Okay, we've got one that's solid hard, but fine. Mm. Wings. Sizzle, drizzle, and nibble. Nibble one more. You've got way more important things to do. Yeah, I know, but I love doing my my food reviews. Yeah, because you like your food, don't you? Maybe I'll spoke too soon. Probably not good, but as I'm getting to the bottom here, literally like wood chips or something. It's so hard that you can't even stab it with a fork. Oh my god. Just to give you an example, let's let's do this. This is one I haven't eaten because it is hard and it's like crunchy as hell. Listen. Holy cow, it's broken pieces. Look at that. Look at that. Something like a potato crisp or a potato chip. And it's... Right, I finished the meal. Just like the first time around, everything was amazing. Flavors were really good. I really enjoy every, every to, to the last bite. It's been 10 minutes now since I've uh, you know, finished the meal. One to 10, been full around eight and a half. The meal was very substantial, very filling. Again, I don't know if, if, if the prices are justified, you know, total of eight pound 90 for both, uh, to make it a meal. Uh, food was delicious. I mean, in the day, I wouldn't say the wings were like amazingly, amazingly good, like, but they were good. Uh, I, I did enjoy the flavors. The flavors weren't too, they weren't too, like, uh, like the buffalo, for instance. It wasn't as spicy as I've tried in other places, but it was good. Um, I especially like the uh, barbecue, uh, barbecue wings. They're that old, uh, it very much reminds you of America, like the old smoky southwest hickory kind of like sauce. It was the chicken, a nice, like, a nice, like, seared crust, if you like, like, chargio crust. And inside the actual meat itself was really tender. You saw the meat coming right off the bone. This is the fries. It may have been just a tad bit overcooked. If you did watch this video to the end, I just want to say a huge thank you. Please do give it a thumbs up because it does help the algorithm. I know I sound very cliche. I know I sound like, you know, like a, a broken record, but the more thumbs up I get, the more I suppose it helps my video and it also tells me that people actually enjoy it. Do check out the my video. I'm, I'm going to do this. If you want to watch my first video of Watch Like The Loaded Box, click here now. Click here now. I don't know if that sounds good or not. But lastly as well, I'll just say that I'm going to put the link in the description below just in case you don't watch the first video and you only watch this video. So, but you have watched it. Thank you for watching and we'll make another one very soon.